we look ahead to November, tonight we're getting our first look at the Democratic presidential ticket. I stand before you today to proudly announce I am now officially the Democratic nominee for President of the United States. The Democrats' virtual roll call wrapped up, officially putting Vice President Kamala Harris at the top of the ticket. She and her newly announced running mate, Tim Walls, appeared for the first time together just hours ago right there in Pennsylvania. They're on a seven-state battleground campaign tour with a stop planned in the Valley coming up this Friday. Tonight, political reporter Ben Brown shows us the sentiment surrounding walls in Arizona. Although it wasn't Senator Mark Kelly, Arizona Governor Katie Hobbs said she is thrilled about Kamala Harris tapping Tim Walls to be her vice president. I've had the chance to work with him directly on many issues and have seen firsthand his dedication to uh, to the American people. But when asked about what he could bring to the ticket, her answer was a little vague. He is America. I mean, he's, as you said, a former high school teacher, a football coach. Uh, he's a hunter. He's a runner. Walls, who served in Congress for 12 years before becoming the governor of Minnesota, signed expansive social welfare programs into law, like free lunch for public school students, codified abortion rights in a state, and increased transgender protections. One area that could pose challenges, especially in Arizona, is the border. I don't know if Walls adds a lot to like border security arguments. I don't think um, Arizona has the same view on that that Minnesota does. If we're going to lose that, that argument, I don't know if there's a VP pick that changes it. I think you need to be convinced that a uh, Harris administration will prioritize securing the border. I can't wait to debate the guy. How do you think J.D. Vance will stack up against Walls, especially as we head into a potential debate here? I think J.D. Vance would stack up incredibly well. J.D. Vance is a master at expressing how policies affect people's lives. Uh, he's a, a policy attack dog. Voters we talked to were mixed. Most didn't know who Walls was, while others wanted Kelly to get the nod. And a few said they don't care who the VP is. We're just asking Arizonans what they think about Governor Walls being picked for the VP. Can I get your thoughts? Uh, I'm not too uh, concerned about it. I don't care one way or the other. Honestly, I like Mark Kelly. Uh, I'm I'm a Tucsonian uh, now, but yeah, um, I don't know much about him. It's Minnesota Governor Tim Walls. I know. Do you like that choice? I mean, he's okay. He's just not very well known, and I think Mark Kelly would have been a better option. Harris will campaign in Arizona on Friday. We asked Governor Hobbs if she will be attending the rally, but she said she doesn't know her schedule yet. Ben Brown, ABC 15, Arizona. Well,